Hey, welcome to the video. Today is just a really quick video to let you know about a new Premiere Pro update. Now, how many times have you made a nice video sequence, maybe for social media, and you've got this perfect sequence and you've got a perfect piece of music as well, but you can't get the music to fit your sequence. Maybe your sequence is 15 seconds long or 30 seconds long and you've got a three minute track. Now, normally what you would do is spend ages chopping the clip up and try to remix it yourself. Or maybe you would just find a bit of the song that you like and then fade it out. But it's a bit dull and a bit vanilla. So Adobe have released an update to Adobe Premiere Pro, which you can get right now today. And it allows you to automatically remix any song. So let's jump into Premiere and I'll show you how this works. So I've got this sequence here that Lewis has put together for Buckle and Band. And this is a quick video for the brand showing how the watch straps are packaged and all put together. And it's for social media. As you can see, the boxes are being folded up. So what we've got is a nice song that I've downloaded from Epidemic Sounds that I think will work really, really well. So I'm going to drag this on here and uh, let's have a little listen to the song. As you can see, it's pretty long. It's uh, over three minutes, 40 seconds long. And whilst it's a good tune, if we just cut it, it's gonna sound a bit dead. So let's play this through. So you can hear it sounds pretty nice, but if we get to the end of the track where you would generally just cut it and fade it out, it's gonna be a bit flat. So if you just ended it like that and you cut there, as you can see, it's, it's not the best. So what you can do with this new feature, what we're gonna do first of all, I'm gonna select the track and within Essential Sound, this is quite important, just select it as a music track first, okay? And then once you've done that, what you can do, if you go over to your Ripple Edit Tool, hold that down and then come across to Remix Tool just here. And then all you need to do, and this is the, the magic part that I like so much, just simply drag the clip to the length of the project. And as you can see here, Premiere has already made loads of loads of little cuts that you can see there on the timeline. So now if I play that through, it's gonna remix the entire project. It's gonna create a start and an end. So it's not gonna uh, end abruptly. So let's play that through now. So you can see that's sounding pretty good. What I'm gonna do, just to save some time, is just go closer to the end and just pay attention to how the end is not just suddenly chopped or just faded out. Listen to this. There you go, and you can see how Adobe has really magically Remix that entire tune so it just fits that exactly. Now, you might be saying, well, I, I, liked, I didn't like that fade, it was a bit too long. What you can actually do here in the right hand side is you've now got some remix options. So you can see here, you've got your target duration. So you can actually make this longer or shorter. So let's just say we actually wanted to make it uh, shorter. Let's say we want to make it end way before the end of that song. You can do that. You could have done that by dragging that in and out. Um, so you've got that option there to make a song shorter or longer, but you've also got customizable segments and variations. So you can choose um, the amount of segments within the remix. So you can adjust your remix by using um, more or fewer edits, or you can have more variations as well. So as you can see here, it just remix to focus on different elements of a song when creating audio. So that tends to work better if you're using music that has a lot of vocal tracks in it or a lot of instruments. So that's essentially a great way you can start using this new feature in Premiere Pro today. Let me know in the comments section below, do you make stuff for social media that's usually 15, 30 seconds or 60 seconds long? I think this could be a bit of a game changer. Let me know in the comments section below and I'll see you in the next video.